Welcome to Exploit Everything, where I show you how to use the glitches in your favorite games to your advantage. This time I'm exploiting the Borderlands 2 Treasure Room glitch. Let's go! Now this glitch has been in the game for months, so if they haven't fixed it by now, you can assume that they won't bother in the future. Basically, it lets you loot and re-loot the Captain Scarlet DLC Treasure Room as many times as you want, instead of only once as the developers intended. There are a couple ways to do it, but here's how I like to. After you finish the original story mode and loot the room for the first time, you head back to the spot in the Wormwater where the lighthouse is pointing, and the Leviathan is going to swallow you again. This will take you back into the uh, Leviathan fight room, and, uh, and you'll be able to go through the whole thing. Okay, after you get swallowed, you'll go through and you'll fight the Roscoe battle one more time. Um, it should be really easy, especially if you've got max level gear. Okay, so you start the fight with Leviathan. Um, there's actually a nested little glitch in here, kind of an exploit, that I'm not sure if it was intended or what the reasoning is, or if it's just a happy coincidence. Um, but you take out his first chest um, vulnerable spot, and then you head through this gate. Now, in the first playthrough, this gate is shut, otherwise you'd just be able to leave. Um, but since this is the second time that I'm fighting him, or, you know, multiple, I can run back through here, and looking to the left of this little tunnel, there is actually an open window that, through this, I can shoot all three of his remaining vulnerable spots. Um, it really cuts down on the time needed to take this monster down. Um, it completely keeps me out of harm's way. And it's, I don't know, it's strange because it seems as though this is too good to be, you know, just a coincidence. It seems as though it's designed this way. But this isn't something that you can exploit during the actual story playthrough, so I can only imagine that this is intentionally left here as a way to take him down quickly the second time through. And he goes down. Alright, now the alternate way that you can exploit this glitch, um, for, for the first playthrough and this time we're going through, you actually run over the Leviathan's body to get to the treasure room. Um, in the glitch mode, the Leviathan is gone, but his invisible body is still there. You can still run over it and exploit the glitch in the same way that I'm about to do. It just takes a little bit more patience, and honestly, to me, it isn't as fun. Um, it isn't as rewarding to get a bunch of loot for, you know, not even firing a single bullet. It's just kind of boring to me. Um, but, you know, to each their own. So what you do is you climb up the arm like this, and you'll get into this corner. You notice to stop moving here, and what you'll want to do is start jumping, then crouch in midair and turn to the left. Um, it may take a couple attempts, but you'll notice to start skating along his side right there, and that's where we want to go. Um, skipped a little bit of time here, and you'll see, you'll start to skate, and then you'll shoot up into the air, just like this. Now, it's kind of an elevator, you'll keep jumping up and up and up, and you'll keep uh, supporting yourself on invisible ledges. Uh, just keep doing that until you go as high as you can. You'll notice when you stop getting higher, you'll just keep, you know, coming back to the same landing spot. Okay, we've got to the top. Um, take a look around so you know what you're looking at. Okay, now, if you'll see here, there are three kind of big purple stones and a kind of a crooked line that looks like a face. Uh, dart right towards that, uh, up until the point where the eyes there just drop off the screen, we can't see them anymore. Turn to the right, you'll see that little white sliver of rock, and you'll dash towards that as well. Now here's where you'll fall off, and it feels like you're going to fall through every time, 
but you should be safe. Now here's where it gets glitchy. You're going to clip through the floor and the wall here. And you have to be really careful because if you take a wrong move, you'll actually fall into, you know, one of many crevices and you'll get stuck and have to start over. You'll see this pink diamond? As soon as you get through the wall, walk towards that. And you're in. All you have to do is loot and you're good to go. <sighs> Didn't get anything really good. The great thing about this exploit is you can do it as many times as you want in quick succession. All you have to do is quit out to the main menu and then hit continue. You'll get back into the Leviathan's belly and you can do it all over again. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time, like, comment, subscribe, and exploit everything.